Hello, I am Dr. Jay Chandra, Senior Interventional Pulmonologist and Clinical Director in Care Hospitals, Banjara Hospital, Hyderabad. Now, there is one question that I have been asked repeatedly. Sir, I have had COVID. I think my lungs are damaged. Do you think I require oxygen? Yes, I have to give a very qualified answer here. The first time around when we had the COVID uh, epidemic, lot of people had this disease. We didn't know what we are dealing with. It came like a bang like this. And a lot of people who had their lungs damaged to a considerable extent, who carried the scars for quite, quite a lot into the future, they always had some compromised lung function. The second time around was also pretty bad. We lost a lot of people. A lot of people whose lungs were damaged, scarred, they took a long time to recover, but not completely. They had some residual damage, which remained with them. So a healthy person, even a 30, 40 year old person, who you expect them to be absolutely in the pink of health, they are scarred for life because the lungs have been damaged because of a severe COVID pneumonia, either during the first or the second phase. Now, having said this, now the third phase, which has been going around, which is the Omicron variant, as uh, you may have heard, this is hardly causing any problem. So you don't find people having severe pneumonia, getting into the hospital, getting admitted, getting oxygen, getting onto ventilator. Maybe it's less than one person, maybe. That's about it, where there is a slight variation or the patient is sick for other reasons. So if somebody asks me now, sir, I got COVID during the third phase, I think my lungs are all damaged and do I require oxygen? I will say no, you will not require oxygen because hardly the lungs have been damaged during the third wave. The first two waves, yes, people had damage. Even now I see them carrying scars. But during the third phase, especially the Omicron, you need not worry. I don't think you have had so many issues with pneumonia or scarring of the lungs as we have seen in the earlier two uh, phases of this disease. Yes, people have had long COVID syndrome as they call it. They continue to be sick after COVID for one reason or the other. They're increasing uh, levels of stroke and heart attacks and this and that. Yes, to an extent true, but that does not automatically mean the third phase is also giving rise to the same level of uh, morbidity as we were seeing in the first and the second phases. So I, right now, let us not play up COVID so much. It is still there among us. We see quite a few cases, but most of the cases, it just passes off as a mild viral infection without significant morbidity. That means without significantly adding to a patient's sickness. It comes off as a mild disease. They could have a severe throat pain for four or five days or even a week. They may be coughing for two, three weeks, but there's no lung damage done, at least during this particular phase. Thank you.